Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading so that we can take a look at the coming week and see how to work best with the energies that are naturally part of it. So the first card is Eight of Fire, Velocity. And the second card is Four of Air, Boundaries. The third card is Major Ten, Opportunity. The fourth card is Achiever of Water, Idealism. And the fifth card is Two of Fire, Impact. So we're beginning our week with fire, which is activity, and we're also ending the week with fire, which is activity. So I want you to know that this is a week where it's important that you act on what you want as opposed to just thinking about it, even though there's some space in the middle of the week to do some thinking and feeling and that kind of stuff. Action is really primary this week. We begin the week with velocity. And what that tells me is that you have the wind under your wings. You've got the ability to really move quickly. When our velocity is here, we've already done something to get this energy moving. So you're not at the very beginning of whatever this is this week. You're riding on something that you set into motion already. We move from velocity to boundaries. Now boundaries talks about simply creating a protected space in which we can grow what we're trying to grow. So whatever vision it is that you're working with this week, you need to give it a sweet spot to sit in where not everybody can get their fingers into it or know about it or see what you're doing. This is a protected space where you nurture it a little bit. From boundaries, we move to opportunity. I love seeing opportunity right in the middle of the week. This tells me that you're working into some new opportunities and you're going to carry those opportunities through into the future. The fact that it follows boundaries tells me that, that this portion of the week where you're establishing and maintaining some boundaries is actually some fertile ground for the new opportunities to show up. From opportunities, we move into idealism. Now that following opportunities tells me that you're going to have a little bit of a tendency to see the ideal in everything that you're looking at, and it's going to be difficult to discern which opportunities are the best ones to follow because you'll be seeing all of them through your idealism. So the way to sort through for the opportunities that are best pursued is to consider the impact that if you do one of those opportunities, what impact will that have in your life or in the world? Make your decision based on the impact that you're trying to have, that you desire to have, as opposed to making the decision just based on the opportunities that are available. So in summary for the week, you've got some energy built up already for whatever you're trying to do. Ride on that energy and enjoy it. Make sure that you provide yourself a place to safely and comfortably at your leisure nurture your visions. Notice the opportunities that show up for you. Recognize that you're seeing them a little bit idealistically and make your decisions about which opportunities to pursue based on the impact you want to have. Have a wonderful, productive week.